Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Alyssa. And I'm Garrett. And we are the Leffersons. And today we have a Disney pin tag for you. I apologize because we have been tagged in a lot of things recently. Yeah. <laughs> and it's been really, really hard to keep up. Today is a Halloween pin tag. We have a lot of other pin tags coming, and we also have another Halloween pin tag coming, because so, we've been tagged in two different Halloween pin tags. This was the first Halloween pin tag we were tagged in, and this is called Witches and Monsters and Pumpkins Oh My, I think. I think that's what it's called. This Sounds was created enough. by Singer Family Adventures. I will leave them linked right up here and down below, and we were tagged by our great friends over in Florida, Daniel and Zach, or the WDW Aristocrats, which we will definitely link them right up here and down below as well. And we're just gonna get right into it, so. The first thing that we had to find is a witch. I was gonna put a picture of Alyssa, but <laughs> Really? Joking. <laughs> we chose the greatest of all the witches, <laughs> Maleficent, in her dragon form. Yes, we actually don't have a lot of like witches. No. Uh, this was the closest thing we had to a witch. We don't really collect a lot of villains or anything, so these Halloween pin tags might be a little tricky for us. I wish the uh, float in Festival of Fantasy blew green fire. That would be cool. That'd be cool. That'd be cool. So that is our witch, the OG witch. Our next pin is a monster pin. Ah. And so of course we had to choose a monster and this is actually Mike Wazowski and what's the teacher's name? No, I have no clue. No idea. Comment down below if you know the teacher's name. But this is from Teacher's Day 2019. And actually the WDW Aristocrats gifted this to us. It is LE2000. It's like they knew. And if you didn't know, we are both in education. I'm a kindergarten teacher, Garrett's a principal, so it only makes sense that we have to have the Teacher's Day 2019 pin. There we go. The third pin that we had to gather from our collection, pick from our field, <laughs> that's bad, is a pumpkin. So obviously- That's a terrible dad joke. I, you know, it happens. Is a, is that Winnie the Pooh yes. pumpkin? Yep. Winnie the Pooh pumpkin. See, just goes right over your face. <laughs> and he's That's like perfect. a jack-o'-lantern and he also has a witch hat. This is one of the only, it might be the only Halloween pin we currently own. I'll just hold over your face the rest of the so, video. It actually looks really great over my face. I'll just talk like a Winnie the Pooh pumpkin. It's fine. The fourth pin category is a creepy crawly. Ooh. And of course they're probably wanting like spiders or like more scary things. We don't have any of that. <laughs> but we do have Heimlich. Heimlich. And he is definitely a creepy crawly. And I actually just got this pin from Box Lunch. It was in our Box Lunch haul. I'll leave that linked up here and down below. But I love this pin because it's when he becomes a butterfly and his butterfly wings are so tiny. <laughs> it's the best part of this pin. I love it. So there's our creepy crawly. Up next is a treat. So we dove into our donut pins. So this is a mini sprinkled donut. They actually had these in the park. Yes, they do still have them in the park. They parks. still have them in the park yes. and they're pretty good. Now the- They're so yummy. The frosting, the pink frosting from Joffrey's, what's it taste? It, it's more like a vanilla. Yeah, it's good. It's more good. like a vanilla. It's not like a strawberry flavor, but the we had to choose the strawberry one because the strawberry frosting is definitely better. Comment uh -oh. down below if you're a chocolate frosting yeah. fan or a strawberry frosted fan or vanilla. But I feel like, especially with the Mickey donuts, I think it's just chocolate. Maybe there is vanilla too. I don't know. But who doesn't love time a to Mickey go back. donut? <laughs> time to go back and find out. I know, time to go back and eat more donuts. <laughs> So our next pin is for a Disney trickster. And so I have none other than our friend Lotso here. He is definitely a Disney trickster. He is probably the only Disney villain that, well, I like. I don't Garrett like still him. doesn't like him. But he is, of course, he's like the perfect trickster because he tricked everyone into thinking that Sunnyside was this magical place when in reality, well, he's a sociopath. He's, <laughs> he's 
he's not a trickster. He's a liar. He is a trickster. He tricked them all into thinking that it was this great place. Whatever. Lotso's the worst. <laughs> he's a trickster, and it's great. This is also a Disney Hollywood Studio Store pin. This is my favorite backing of any pin. I love the ice cream cones. Okay, so the next one is a Disney character in a dis in a disguise or a costume or dressed as another character. <laughs> we just got this bit and I <laughs> we had to put it in here because it's amazing. So this is poo and I'm strategically replacing a word <laughs> and it says which better have my honey. Like, better have my honey. And of course, Winnie the Pooh is dressed up as like a pimp. And if you don't know what a pimp is, don't find out. If you're too young to know, then leave it at that. Okay, <laughs> moving on. The next pin represents death. <laughs> Why are you putting it over my face? Because it's the bride. We have Constance the bride from Haunted Mansion. And I think she definitely represents death because she killed everyone. She kills all of her husbands. <laughs> that is by far my favorite part of Haunted Mansion. That is my favorite room of Haunted Mansion. There's, I just love There's the so water. much to look at in that room. There's I, so I much. wish the ride, you always break down whenever you're going back down to the, into the graveyard. I just want to break down in that room and just. We, I have broken down in that room before and yeah. I'm able to, I was able to hear like all of her different sayings mm -hmm. till death do us part. Oh, it's so great. So great. All right, the next one is a mythical creature. And well, we didn't have a lot of mythical creatures, but then I thought of, well, a mermaid is a mythical creature. And here is an aerial pin. And I do love these portrait pins. They are from a mystery pin box. And I love the little details on the frame. Just love this pin. So there's Ariel being a mythical creature. <laughs> And a Halloween pen tag would not be a Halloween pen tag if it did not involve night. Yes. So we chose a pen with a castle. And as you can see, I got to hold it the other way. <laughs> there we go. So this is uh, the fireworks show. It could be wishes. It could be happily ever after. Any well, nighttime show at Magic Kingdom, basically. So you have yourself Tinkerbell, who flies down from the tower and the fireworks and the nighttime shows are the best part of going to Disney. Yes. So of course we had to pick that as our night pin because why not? And that is it. <laughs> Those are all of our pins. I'm hiding the word on one of our pins, but these are all of our pins. Okay, so now it is time to tag two more channels. We are going to tag The Princess and the Sith. Definitely go check them out. They do a lot of fun unboxings and a lot. They're also a Disney couple, which is great. So love that. Definitely go check them out. And we are also going to tag another Disney couple, the Game Boys over at the Game Boys channel, Tim and Johnny. Definitely go check them out as well. And that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below with what your favorite pin was and subscribe to our channel for more Disney content. Thanks for watching and we'll see you real soon. Bye. See you later.